morning in the shade of the rotunda, the group started work on an oriental mural, a hundred feet long and ten feet high, to be erected when completed in her street near the proposed Chinatown redevelopment area. The Supreme Graffiti team were commissioned jointly by West Midlands County Council and Birmingham Initiative Partnership. It's their fourth project to date and their reputation as genuine street artists is growing rapidly throughout the Midlands. It's a mural on a Chinese theme to demarcate a, a Chinese, recognizable Chinese tourist area in the city. Did you need to get the final design for this mural passed by anyone in particular? Yes, we needed to go to the head of the Chinese community, a gentleman called Roger Lee, and uh, he had a look at it, and uh, with one or two amendments, he okayed it. What about the finished product? If she comes along and says, well, I want this changing and that changing, you quite happy to do that? Uh, yes, I think, um, you know, obviously within certain boundaries, I think we can make changes because uh, this form of art is quite quickly executed. I would say it's probably the largest public spray can mural project that has ever been undertaken in the country. Vandals have already had a go at the mural, but the specially mixed tins of paint can easily wipe out any traces of illegal graffiti. Cliff Price is the designer and an expert in this form of street art that originated in America as a method of brightening up the inner city areas. The finished mural will look like this pattern in about four days' time, and it'll make an eye-catching addition to the city skyline.